What's up guys, Denner here, playing Nindo RPG right now, and I just got this new uh, sub scroll. it's called, actually I don't know what it's called since it's not telling me, but it's like something like a uh, Josh, yeah, that's, it's legit called Josh, but I'm going to be showing it off today because people are saying that it's actually quite OP, I think it's actually not bad either, it's, it's pretty OP, but I think it's only OP in, in a closed ranked match or something like that because like legit they can get out of it really easily I'll showcase it right now you guys will understand after this I'll also be comparing it to the other modes soon so stay in tune for that and before I start the video don't forget so you guys just know uh, at the bottom right of the YouTube video there's a subscribe button you don't have you don't even have to pause the video to subscribe just click on it and click subscribe and it'll be perfectly fine like the video if you guys will like the video and comment down below if you have any questions whatsoever but yeah let's get let's get into the video okay i'm gonna show i'm gonna show what it looks like when you charge up right now it's actually pretty cool it's not bad i, I don't really like the look too much though but basically what this does is that if you're close to an enemy it'll it'll automatically start damaging them and it'll steal their hp and chakra they can move but they'll they'll move really slowly but the, there's two ways you can get out of this mode I mean, there's two ways to get, you can get out of it. Actually, is you can double jump and dash away, and you can also uh, you can also use like if you have like eight gates or curse mode, you can you can just charge up your uh, chakra thingy, and then like charge up your beast like how he's gonna show right now. Yeah, like that. And it's actually easy to get away if you charge it up like that. So that's what I'm saying about how easy it is to actually not get hurt by uh, this new mode. But yeah, it's basically fine. I'm gonna show you guys the HP regen and the chakra regen. It's actually pretty good if, like I said, if you're in, in close combat. Okay guys, I'll show you guys how it works. Basically you just charge up and you just walk next to them and they can't do anything except for run, which is actually not bad. See so, uh, how I am gaining 10 chakra per, per second and uh, three HP per second, so, which is good. See how he slowed when he runs away? So it's it kind of counters people who, who try to run uh, th he can try to dash away, but it's not really... You can also dash with him so you can catch up. Like I said, there's only two ways to uh, block it, so yeah. Okay guys, we're back. I'm gonna actually you guys gonna show you a combo with this new mode. It's actually not bad. You can also you can also combo it with other chakra moves. So it's actually pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna show it to you right now. I'm gonna charge up real quick. And I'm gonna walk up to this guy and I'm gonna just gonna stun him. And he's still gonna get hurt. And there's also another way you can also Genju to them. I'll do it in a few seconds after I charge up my Genjutsu. You just walk up to him. You're just like, pa, And they're, they also take a little bit of damage. You, can, you know, it's fine. Yeah, the, the, this is this is basically OP for something like that. Uh, they might, I think it is a glitch though for the Genjutsu in the water. So they could patch that or not. Because I honestly think uh, they don't need to. Because this is actually really, really, uh, this, this mode is actually really underwhelming at the moment so i hope they keep it the same because that actually makes some strategy to this or else you're just gonna walk around using like 5,000 mds per second just to damage them a little bit and steal the hp i mean you can you can just summon the, the slug and uh get hp back as basically faster than than what you're getting now so i hope they keep it like that but yeah guys that's basically it on the show case of this new uh mode i was trying to get more into death but there's not much to go into death on because it's trash not really though but kind of i'll be making another video about comparing the three modes the eight gates the the new mode that i just showcased right now and the curse mode they they all three have something different in them and they all three have different strategies to use them against i'll be showing you guys which one I actually like the best. So stay in tune for that. I have made videos on this game before, tutorials. You can check that out at the end screen. It's gonna be a playlist of full of videos. There's some about all the summon and scroll locations, the fastest way to level up and get money, and also the location of the new scroll jutsu, the one that I just showed you guys. There's also an everything you need to know video for those who are new to this game and want to know tips and tricks and how things work in this game. But yeah, that's basically it, guys. I'll be making more videos soon. Stay in tune for that. Subscribe, like, and comment. Hit that bell notification button. 
to get more updates on when my videos will come out. Just follow me on Twitter. I'll be updating you guys on my video editing and stuff so you guys can look at it and be like, oh wow, he's updating a video right now. I can, uh, I can watch it and get ahead of all these other people. So you guys can do that. <laughs> it would help me out. And hopefully, if I do things right, it'll help you out too. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked the video. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.